This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. Well, uh, Brock Lesnar, Shelton Benjamin, Jason Jordan, Chad Gable, so many others uh, are all going to go ahead and get the check mark by Jerry Briscoe's name. Yep. Of course, he became a, a hardcore champion as well, and lots of other little silly accomplishments in the WWE that got him on TV. But when it came down to uh, fans really paying their respects, he went into the Luthez Professional Wrestling Hall of Fame in 2005, WWE's Hall of Fame in 08 the Florida chapter of the national wrestling hall of fame in 2018. But unfortunately last year, 2020, after 36 years with the company, Mr. Briscoe was let go by WWE 36 years though. Hell of a run. Yeah. Was it not? That's what I'd rather look at it as Conrad 36 years of one company in the wrestling business is an amazing account. It is unbelievable. You're absolutely correct. Uh, but it was just sad to see him go. Because I felt like that based on what we had, the, the role that we had created with Jerry for Jerry, he could have still done that job. And I think that sometimes, uh, you know, all the politics of creating the NXT brand and, and who's in charge and who this, and you know, we know they're undergoing some change now and so forth and so on. So the politics roar on, uh, but Jerry could have still fulfilled a great role. And I think that he still does to kind of unofficially he'll some coach. See, here's the deal. Conrad coaches now believe that Jerry's their guy. Right. And so when they got a kid that they believe has the aptitude and, and the motivation to be a pro wrestler, they call Jerry, they call Jerry. Yeah. They still call Jerry. And then Jerry then will, you know, turn the lead over to somebody else or, or hook up somebody in a phone call at the time. It might've been when he was there, Canyon Seaman whomever it may be, Jerry was still contributing and helping out the WWE because he was loyal for all those years of earning a paycheck, all those 36 years and the money that he earned and, and so forth. He was still loyal. And that's why we've talked about him a lot today is the fact that he was just so loyal and he had this wonderful eye for talent. Goodness gracious. He was a great eye for talent. Best I ever saw. So, uh, and again, he was re very responsible for the success that WWE had right after they, we turned, uh, 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 public, publicly traded company. We needed new faces, new talents. We need to create our own stars. And Jerry was there on the spot to make sure we got that done. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell. So you get a notice anytime we upload some new content and go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30 year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.